Welcome to day 21, the final day of our 21 day DAX challenge. We have covered various things like customers, employees, products, and now we are ending today with a strong looking at the suppliers, but with a slightly sharper lens. Instead of just counting suppliers, today's question is which supplier offers the most diverse product range? Okay. In other words, who is supplying the highest number of unique products to our business. So let's build a clean DAX measure that returns the name of the top supplier based on how many distinct products they supply. Okay, let's begin. So we will divide this function into four parts. The very first thing, we'll just create a, a measure over here and uh, we'll just create a virtual table. Before that, the name of this particular uh, measure would be top diverse supplier equals we will have a table named as variable table remember so since we want a supplier with unique products we'll create a table for each supplier and how many products they supply okay so to create a virtual table we will use the add columns values we want supplier id from the suppliers table okay then definitely the next thing we want as the product count okay product count will become a name of the column but what do we want in the product count the count of rows okay in the products table okay so this will give us the count of all the products in the products table so that's the first thing now step two is getting the maximum number of products supplied by one supplier okay what are the maximum number of products so we can say here that the max count equal to max the t will be virtual table and the product count would be the numerical column over there okay now step three would be find the supplier who has the max count okay so you'll use the variable as top id equals to max and we want to filter the t table based on comparing the data which is product count equals to max count okay that's the answer but at the output what we need is we need supplier id now once we get the supplier id with the help of that uh, filter and max function now finally we want to return the output returning output will become based on the lookup value company name based on the supplier id and then we want to find out with the help of top id okay so that's it and once we press enter it will give the supplier name who offers the widest product range okay so when i minimize this when I go back here, when we drag and drop, okay, when we drag and drop, it tells us Dell Technologies is a company which has the variety, okay, maximum uh, type of options they have uh, and that's the company name as Dell Technologies. That's a supplier, okay. And that's it. Challenge 21 is completed, everyone. Over the past 21 days, you have built some of the most practical and powerful DAX functions which are used in the real business world. Okay, covering everything from the customer insights to employee performance and supplier analytics. If this helped you, make sure you like, subscribe and share with your team or learning group. This might be the end of the challenge, but it is just the beginning of your Power BI mastery. I'll see you in the next project and all the best.